just getting into Pennsylvania, probably about 15, 20 minutes ago. Headed east on I-70, driving about, what is it, eight hours almost? Yeah, yeah about eight hours. Yeah. Um, this is uh, this is kind of an odd camping destination we're looking for here. Yeah. The abandoned Pennsylvania Turnpike is where we're headed. Um, a 13 mile stretch of road, some tunnels. Uh, this, this section was abandoned in the 60s. Yeah. Um, so anyway, we're, we're headed there, we're gonna hike it, and we're gonna camp it. Yep, sounds yeah. like a fun time. Yeah. We actually brought Mika too. Um, here she is. Let's see here. Here she is. She's made herself a little bed by. Um, Mika Pug. Here we go. Okay. Just starting off at the uh, hotel here. That's going to be our parking. Um, yeah. We read about the graveyard here. The trail is going to be uh, a little further down this way. We already passed it. Driving in. How's that pack, Jenna? Um, it's heavier than last time. I would say it's probably a good 25 pounds. 25 pounds this time. What'd you have last time? I would say like 19. Yeah. 1856. That's crazy. What's that? October 16th, 1856. Dude. This is an old cemetery. Yeah. That one's 1843. That's crazy to even think about. This is the uh, parking that we read about. You can park here. Not a whole lot. Not a whole lot for space. But I guess the trail starts just up that hill. Look familiar? Yep, it does. All right, cool. more all right did you get all that yep i don't think they did oh like they well they just missed the sign it's like right on the other side that's right yeah. yeah otherwise they would have known So, we knew we need flashlights, right? Right. I'm hoping we got enough. I brought uh, two stream lights, right. one in each pack. We got um, the two Eddie Bauer headlamps, which okay. we'll probably use in the tunnels quite a bit, right. and uh, four of the Harbor Freight cheapos. Actually, everything we've got are cheap flashlights, but uh, I did bring spare batteries, yep. so we got that going for us. And two lighters, if all else fails. Yeah. This pack, uh, you know, it's, it's not a good sign. This pack is already, like, really heavy. How's yours? It's heavy. Heavy? Yeah. It, it will get a little lighter. Flat. Yeah. Compared it's supposed to, that to be pretty Utah flat. trail that we did. Well. Oh, there's no way I could do that with this pack. Compared to any Utah trail, right? Oh my gosh, that was so uphill. What's she doing, Jenna? Is she on the scent of something? Yeah, I think it's some like zombie carcass. Zombie carcass? Uh -huh. Wait, I guess that would be a zombie. Would that be like a functioning zombie? Maybe. No, that doesn't look honest. I don't know, I wouldn't be surprised if this area is full of them. There you go. That's the answer. Uh -huh. And meow. And meow. Meow. 
How many times can you say meow? Meow. 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 You're at five. Don't meow. stop now. Meow. Wait, why are you doing this? Meow. Meow. <laughs> meow don't know? <laughs> <laughs> you getting scared? Yeah, very scared. I can tell. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You did get your knife out. I did. I have it prepared for zombies. No. Yep. Or bombs. Or bombs, yeah. <laughs> Either or. Yeah. Or zombie bombs. Zombie bombs, sure. All right, I was seeing things earlier. That was that was not a tunnel 10 minutes ago, but that is down there, Jenna. That is a tunnel. Yeah. Looks and dark. Get some of the view or with the bridge and stuff that you can make. What's that say? Horton. Horton, oh. Triple X. Horton Triple X, woo! They probably went through Ohio then. You know, what's this Ohio thing? Triple X in Ohio? Yeah. Um, we saw how many different adult superstores going through Yeah, Ohio? and they're called superstores, too. Yeah. Like, what does it take to be an adult superstore? I don't know. Is it like a Walmart say, size? Yeah, I think you can buy groceries there, too. <laughs> yeah. That'd be convenient. Uh-huh. Right? Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, we saw four of them going through Ohio. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. That's just on I-70. Who knows where? How many more are on other freeways? See that. Yeah, we're getting closer to this tunnel. It looks dark. It does look dark. It actually gets darker around it too, which is weird. Mm, yes. Mm -hmm, yeah, it's very dark. It looks yeah. very steep up there, and I heard, uh, I heard the the areas above and around this tunnel are just overrun with zombies. Uh -huh. So it's too dangerous to go around. Yeah, it also said on the sign that you can't go up there. Okay. So between those two factors, yeah, we uh we have to go through this tunnel. Uh -huh. Yep, you can't go above it. Dang. All right. Well, here we are, the first tunnel. What's the name of this one, Jenna? Race. This one's Race. I think we can see the end down there. I don't know, with one of these it's supposed to be an illusion. Like you think you see the end of it and it's not, it's actually like a reflection. I think that one though is the actual end. Yeah, some of the some of the graffiti here, like this one, is actually pretty cool. Whoever did this, this is awesome. That's some decent work. Not that I condone any of this. The skull's kind of cool next to our pack. Oh yeah. Oh, some love notes. So we'd like to go in here. It's been welded shut. Somebody's tried. Somebody's tried getting in here. Looks like they got close and gave up. I can try. I really. I can try get in there if I really want to. Do you really want to get in there, though? No, I'm okay. There's nothing but needles and aids in there. Oh yeah, look up there. Dang. That's cool though. We could put Mika in there. No. Mika, what do you think? That's a biscuit. She's not up for that. Yeah, she's up for a biscuit though. She's always up for a biscuit. Taking the packs off even though we've only, only been at it for about, what, half an hour? 45 minutes? Yeah, probably. Got all kinds of goodies down there. Here come. Here go. Oh, she didn't have to do anything for that one? No, she's been good. Jeez! Good girl! Yeah, it's not loud enough. Echo! Any zombies down there?
I didn't hear him answer, did you? That's, sounds like it's clear. What do you think? You ready? Yep. First tunnel? Mm-hmm. Mika, are you ready? That's a cheesy line, Mika. Seriously, that's like from an 80s movie. She's so good. I wonder if I'll have to carry her like a little baby. Oh, look at the baby. Look at the little baby. Yeah, I kind of, I like this skull right here too. Oh, this that's, one. That's easy though. Yeah, I know, but he's kind of cool. Yeah. He's a cool skull. He's smoking. So, you know, that oh, makes anybody that cool. Make, that gives him extra cool points. Yeah. That's pretty sweet. Yeah. Be careful with your pack. It looks like it's going to That kind of makes me want to buy a pack of cigarettes. Uh-huh. That's kind of interesting. It says, Real Real reality is an illusion. The universe is a hologram. Buy gold. Buy. Do you think that's true? Yeah, I bet it is. It has to be. If it's on the wall, it must this be is true. This is buy, like it's gone. Oh. Buy gold, buy. Well, what is this little guy? Well, that's like a map. This is a map. It looks like a it's like, pyramid. This is, did you see National Treasure? Yeah. This is just like National Treasure. Oh, so if the we... The eye sees, like, that's a pyramid, and then there's the eye. So if we followed that map, we would find gold? Or, like... Or another... Pirate booty. Oh, pirate booty? I'm confused. Okay. Pirate booty. Pirate booty. Like, this type of pirate? We're at uh, probably about 1 o'clock, 1.30 in the afternoon. You think she's scared? I think she's scared of the Oh, you got her. Here, shine. Shine a light. Yeah. Don't worry, Mika, we got gotcha. you. Just coming to the end of the first tunnel. Jenna has uh, wiped the blood off of her knife. Mika has uh, we cleared the hair out of her teeth. Got through that one okay. Took, I don't know, maybe 10 minutes to get through. It's almost like a Bart meets. It's like Mr. Burns, but not really. It's Simpsons esque. It is really Simpsons esque. Oh, look at this. There we go. Oh, there's a hobo in here, Jenna. He's drunk. There's crap in the way. Well, don't let her eat anything. Fart. Mika, that's you. You fart a lot. Oh, that's Obviously. actually cool. What's that? I'm going to take a picture of it. It's what? a bat. I thought you were looking at that penis. No, it's a bat. It's a penis? Does look like something that'll fall out. Be a good place to survive. Uh -huh. Good shelter. Coincidentally, Fallout 4 just came out this last week, right, Jenna? Oh yeah, that's right. And I am not playing it. How come? Um, because we're doing it in real life. This is the real life Fallout. Yeah. yeah. Like that, yeah. Narrow passageway. What's this? It's kind of a cool picture. I like it. It's like a family portrait. Every morning before I went to school, fed the chicken and I chopped wood too. Sweet, dude. That's, yeah. a, that's a good, good thing. Now 
Is it just me or does it seem like a ton later out here, like in the day? I think we lost time. You think, you think we're in a different time? Yeah. Like a different time and space? Hey, we could go up there. Tempting. Maybe we'll do that tomorrow on the way back. You're like a Japanese tourist. I know. Aren't you like 164th Japanese? No, I'm not at all. Oh. Uh, I think, oh, well, Mika's Chinese, so does that make a difference? Mika's Chinese, okay, yeah. So I'm her mother, so I guess to a point, yeah. Okay. By adoption. By adoption? Mm -hmm. Oops. <laughs> I gotta get a close up of this. She has a tail. I think that's a, it's a woman doing the, I, I don't know, it's gross. Okay, so different interpretations here. Yeah. Jenna, what do you see? I see a dog. So there's a dog there, and now that you mention it, I see the dog. See, I'll point but it, you I see the, you see the woman though. Yeah, I With see. the tail and the weird, well no, that's her arm back there. Oh, I see it now. And the tail, yeah. But see, look, I see a dog right yeah. here. Like look, a dog facing that way. His leg. Chica says she sees a dog. And then actually I see the woman now too, but it looks like Yeah, it's a woman with a tail. Tail, yeah. Yeah. Like here's her face and the arm. Yeah. But okay. I really see the dog going that way more than anything. It's like one of those psychology posters where they ask you what to what you see in a picture. Yeah. It's supposed to be a bat every time though. That's how they get you. All right, moving on. So we've been walking for about, what do you think? Close to two hours now. Yeah, it's been about two hours. We were just having the discussion. We might be, uh, we might be fighting, losing daylight. Yeah, the sun is there right now. So. Which translates to a little after two o'clock. Yep. Uh, yeah, we got a total of something like 13 miles. And we wanted to get to the end and camp somewhere down there. I don't know, we'll see. I'd like to set up camp while it's still light. What's Mika think? I think Mika's getting a little tired, but I don't know. One thing's for sure, we're carrying too much. Yeah, it's heavy. The low, we, we checked now, the low's only supposed to be 42 overnight. Yeah. A windy 42. The 42 isn't too bad. We, we carried a lot more layers for that, didn't we? Well, we thought, last time I checked on the temperature, it said that it was going to be like 34. Yesterday. So. Just, just yesterday it said that. We prepared for that because last time we camped when it was 34, we were pretty cold. Oh man. Um, yeah. So we didn't want that again. But we got, we got an extra blanket. Yeah. We've got like three layers each yeah. of clothing. How's Mika doing? I think she's getting kind of tired, but she wasn't thirsty. We tried to give her water. No, she wasn't thirsty that last stop. You almost fell over at that last stop. It's because there's really not much to sit on out here. Well, so you kind of just squat down in the middle of the road. And my backpack um, pretty much took me backwards. <laughs> took you backwards. Yeah, I wish I had got it on camera, by the way. Sorry. Yeah. I'm glad you did not. Yeah, sorry. I missed it. Yeah. Um, hopefully we're getting near the what's called the sidling. Am I saying that right? I'm, sidling tunnel. Yeah, sure. yeah. Yeah. Which is supposed to be the longer one. Creepier one. Yeah, right. And I don't know what we're going to do about camp. Yeah, Let's see. It's a lot of hiking though. With this much weight on pavement. That's just me being a wuss though. Yeah, me too. Mika, you're not even carrying your weight. No, she says not nope. carrying anything. No. Okay. 
keep going around the corner slowly, waiting to see another tunnel. We've been doing this corner for a while now. Yeah. I'm thinking that it's going to come out here soon, but it keeps turning. I thought I heard that this was used as like a race track at some point, or test track. For... That'd be cool. That would be cool. If the concrete, or if the uh, asphalt was in better shape though. Yeah. Horrible shape for as old as it is. Yeah, well, you take oh. all the vehicles off it for yeah. 50 years or whatever. Mm -hmm. All right, still hiking. No tunnel in sight yet. You probably can't tell from video, but that that's been a long, a long ascent to get here. Ugh. We keep saying it's just around this next bend or it's just up that hill. Looking for the tunnel that is. And we finally have it hope. Is. It <laughs> is actually there. Yeah. Uh -huh. That would be the sidling tunnel. I think I'm saying that right. Your guess is better than mine. Okay. Yeah, here we go. This is supposed to be the longer one too. It's about uh, just coming up on four o'clock. We we're going to, uh, we're losing our light and we want to get camp set up and just kind of kick back and relax. I wish I had had that response on video, what'd you say? I said, wow, look, that's a really long penis. It is a long penis. A little bit of humor in our uh, current situation. There's where we started on the side of the tunnel. Man, this thing is just about pitch black in here. I see why they say this is the creepier of the tunnels. You can see some light, just some faint light down there at the end. Um, and I'm told that's kind of a, that's an illusion, either from the light, from uh, reflecting off a corner or maybe from behind us. But man, it is, it is dark in here. It's getting colder too. It's probably at least 20 degrees colder than outside. I, I don't know about say. 20. I would say Maybe 20 degrees from when we started earlier today. It is really cold in here. Down in here, it, yeah, the temperature dropped quite a bit. Okay. We're just carrying her. We've got her on the leash because we want to just keep her, keep her a little close. We don't know. We've already seen some random pieces of steel and some glass. And just trying to keep an eye on her a little bit here. Her eyesight's not good anyways, but then it's completely pitch black too, so I feel kind of bad for her right now because she really can't see. The reason we're saying that too is her, um, she is blind in one eye, for those that don't know. She's, she's young, and she's got a lot of energy, but she's got that kind of handicap going for her, so we have to be careful with some stuff. Stop her from doing anything. She'll still do anything, that's for sure. Oh, that's an impressive picture. Look at that one right there. Such, such detail. I know. Oh, look, there's, oh, oh, look, there's a gnome. Somebody's writing like a whole novel in here. It is, yeah. I'm too lazy to read it. Uh, How's the red light work? No, hardly at all. The uh, female shape. Here. Yeah. Well, it is a different state. Yeah, that's true. Mm -hmm. Maybe they're different here in Pennsylvania. Could be different. All right. No zombies yet in this tunnel. Nope. Thought I heard some. Mm -hmm. Wait, what was that? All right, we made it out out of the sidling tunnel. I hope I'm saying that right. I need to see it spelled. 
This one has a door open we can access. What do you think, Jenna? It looks good. Mika made it. We carried her a little bit of the ways, but let's go check this out. I put away my flashlight too soon. There's a chair in here. You got light? Another room back here. It's up here. Nothing. Nothing much you can get to in here. All right. Well, we're gonna go scope out up top and see if we can find a uh, good camp spot. Does that sound good, Jenna? Get these packs off? Yeah. This, uh, That'll be good. It's a bit of a hike. Mm -hmm. It is a bit of a hike. Looks like we can probably go up here, over to the top somewhere and see, see if we can find some good shelter. Let's do it. Okay. Just climbed up to the top, just above the tunnel here. And up on the top, it's a nice sheltered area. Camp out for the night. We just got here about two minutes ago. Jenna hasn't even taken her pack off yet. Not yet. I got a fire pit. I think I've seen this before somewhere. I think so. <laughs> Look at this, speaking of pit. This is pretty cool here. Check this out. Speed racer. Good drawing. That's excellent, yeah. You know, I definitely don't mind some of this graffiti when it's done like that. I mean, it's already, it's already a lost cause with regards to, uh, you know, defacing of all this, this old stuff, but let's see what's on the other side here. Oh, nice oh cool. we were motivated we could get in there and scope it out oh there's some of the uh, ventilation turbines those giant those giant um, venting fans for the tunnel yeah it's definitely not blocked off there's another access down here does not appear to be blocked off yet. Kind of surprised. One, two, step. Okay, come on, Mika. Yeah, it's going to be slippery. It's a lower level, too. Huh, okay. Keep, keep her on a leash. Really watch yourself. Okay. I'll take the camera. Okay. It's fine.
Mr. Speed Racer. Okay. Watch your step. Yeah, crazy. That's muddy in here, isn't it? Let's check out the other side. Wow. Try it downstairs. Stairs have been taken out here. But it hasn't stopped people from getting down there. Uh, I bet this is a party room. Oh, yeah. Party! Oh, this one? Uh-huh. It's really yeah. cool. I like it a lot. His little belly button that he does. The there was beard. one in the there was one in the siling tunnel that we didn't get on camera that was really cool. See, here's one of them too. Look at this. This is another one. He does a beard every time too. And the little X for the belly button. Uh -huh. Wet in here. Kind of cool. All right. Just now getting the last bit of light. It's pretty much dark down where we're at. We've got our tent set up. Jenna got that all set up. I got the, the rest of the campsite here squared away. We got our tents in there. Here's our bags. Got the tarp down. I don't think it's going to rain tonight. Not supposed to rain tonight, is it, Jenna? No. No. Check this out. We found this spot. We got a couple of benches here. And there is a fire pit, but we, uh, we decided not to make a fire. But the biggest reason we came to this spot, you can probably hear it. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. We got running water down here, which is excellent because our water was going to be a little tight anyway, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. We can filter it, uh, yeah. and we'll do so in the morning um, with the uh, Sawyer filter. But uh, yeah, we had a good spot over there next to, um, or right, ab right above the sidling tunnel, which is, oh, we're about five minutes away from there. Um, it was a good spot, but just judging how much traffic is over there and maybe not the best kind of traffic, um, we wanted to get away from it a little bit. So we are uh, we kind of got our own little sheltered spot the, uh, the road to the tunnel is just through there, down that way a little bit. So we're kind of sheltered down in here. Good little spot for the night. About to make some dinner. Okay, we got the Jetboil Minimo fired up. This thing is awesome. Just getting some water enough for one meal. I'm gonna go for the, uh, this is a new one, Jenna. Yeah. Alpine Air. I'm here and I got the spicy sausage pasta. Jenna says she wasn't hungry yet, so we're gonna wait on that. But I'm gonna go for mine. And yeah, I got this little ledge to work with. That's working out great. Uh, that's the uh, Smith & Wesson shield back there. Don't leave home without it. Yeah, nice little spot. And it's only uh, 5.30. I know, that seems so much and It's just later. about fully dark. Yeah, Mika's got her little uh, her little night jacket on. 
<laughs> She's tired. She's, She's got tired. her bone too. She's normally chomping away at this, but... I think she's just too, she's too tired, tired for that. Yeah. She might want to go lay in bed. Yeah, she'll, she'll sleep good tonight. And she will definitely sleep in one of the sleeping bags with us. Oh yeah, she? she'll yeah. be in mine hopefully. She'll be. <laughs> <laughs> you got her last time though. I know, it was awesome. Yeah, I, I was freezing. I could have used that little pug body. I know. Uh, oh, seriously, this is like already boiling. That's awesome. It's so fast. Yeah. All right, cool. Freeze-dried meals. These things have been good so far. Oh, that one looks good. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Okay. We shall see. Let's see if I can do this without burning myself. Mm -hmm. And we've had this trouble before. There we go. All right. I am totally guessing at the... Uh, is there a fill line in there? Mm -hmm. I doubt it. But I see. I'm totally guessing at the amount of water. 12 ounces is what it's supposed to be. Sure. Looks good. I think that's about right? Yeah. And oh my god, 12 to 15 minutes. Seriously? Wow. It's like okay. a lifetime. <laughs> Alright. So the wind is picked up and the pug is bundled. There yes, we go. She she's got a she's got a jacket of her own now. Uh-huh. Yeah. So we got two meals. Jenny, you decided to uh, you decided you were hungry after all after you got a whiff of this stuff. Okay. You went with the chili mac with beef, uh -huh. which we just got some boiled water and that one that is in the what's the wait time on that? Eight to nine minutes. Eight to nine. That's not as bad as mine. Mine's probably got a couple more minutes to go. Uh -huh. This thing is awesome. Yeah, it's really Boiled water so fast. Yeah, the wind's definitely picked up and it's gotten chilly out here. Speaking of chilly. Mm -hmm. And it's uh, not even six o'clock yet. We got a couple of books. But yeah. It's gonna be kind of a... Early night. An early night and maybe a creepy one too, huh? Uh -huh. A little bit. Yeah. But we are up at like what time? Three thirty this morning. Oh yeah, we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna sleep so well. Yeah, we're gonna sleep. Yeah. Good. All right. Can you hand me a spoon? I think I've waited long enough on this thing. These are awesome spoons too. Oh yeah, we had to pick up the the MSR spoons. That's the matching set to the forks that we have, which I don't have out here to show, but they're awesome. Yeah, they're really nice, lightweight, um, foldable too. Foldable. Love that. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay, here we go. Yep. Here, oh. open that for me. Um, How does it look? It doesn't look done yet. Not yet? Mm -mm. Here, I probably need to stir it. Did we get enough water? Yeah, it's actually looking pretty good, but okay. maybe just a few more minutes. A few more minutes? Sure. Oh, look at you. You get the taste tester bite. How is it? Really? Uh -huh. It's cooled down, huh? Yeah. Probably could have put them in like our backpacks or something to insulate them. That yeah, we'll out here in the, We could do that with yours. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's already I don't care if it's cold. Yeah. It's like a pasta salad. <laughs> yeah, look at this. Right in here. I'm sure it's upright, but now it's kind of out of the wind. Yeah, it looks all right. There's still some, still some steam coming off there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's cooled down though. Yeah. That's pretty good. I wouldn't say it's spicy though. Mm. Or at least I the bite. I just got a spicy bite. Oh, okay. I mean, I wouldn't call it hot, but mm -hmm. it's not bad. Yep. And like we were talking about, Everything tastes better after you've been hiking this much. Everything tastes better. All right, mine was good, okay. and it was uh, uh -huh. lukewarm. Okay, but this yeah. one, the chili mac with beef, is awesome. I just had a bite of that. We waited about 10 minutes. It's uh -huh. still plenty hot. Look at this. Take a look at that. Talk about a hearty dinner. Yeah, yeah. That kind of woke uh, Mika up um, a little bit. That is, it's gonna be nice and warm too. 
Um, I couldn't stop there because uh, we burned a lot of calories today, so I'm boiling some more water. And I've got this packet here, which believe it or not, is a ready to eat beef with barbecue sauce sandwich. And they can be eaten cold, but you can heat them up in, in the packet um, in some hot water. So that's what I'm gonna do. This How's it is going so over there? Good. Is it? Can I have another bite? Mm -hmm. Here, I'll use my spoon. Where did it go? Let's see if I can do this with the camera. Oh my god, am I gonna get it? I don't know. I got most of it. It is so good. Oh, that is really good. The chili is really good. Yeah. Surprisingly. Mm hmm I would say this is honestly my favorite. My favorite freeze dried meal. Yeah. Yeah, the freeze dried meals. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that one's really good. I still like the uh, sweet and sour, the sweet and sour pork that we've had. Mm -hmm. That one was awesome. And already we're to a boil. Okay, yeah. I'm putting this camera down. All right, I got this area cleaned up for the night. Everything we have is in the tent. And we are looking forward to a full night's sleep. All right, Jenna? Yes. Where's Mika? She's right here. There she is. Um, oh, she's I just, ready for it too. I just took my boots off and oh, it feels good. Yeah, I'm ready to join you. Okay. All right, that's it for the camera. Good night. Okay, so we, uh, this, this was our campsite. We woke up about an hour and a half ago, slowly made our way out of bed, packed up the tent, got our backpacks uh, all ready to go. Jenna, you were a little reluctant to... Uh, to get out. To get out, I was yeah. too. We actually slept really, really well. Really well. We used the uh, REI Half Dome, Half plus. Dome Plus tent, yeah. which is awesome. And yeah, we made sure to wear plenty of layers this time so we weren't cold in the middle of the night. Yeah. I was I was really comfortable. I slept so good. So yeah, good. <laughs> yeah. I think we slept a good, um, boy, eight hours plus, eight yeah. hours, and eight, eight and a half, ten, somewhere like ten. that. Well, it was, eight, it was eight to maybe nine, somewhere in there. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Mika really slept good. well. She yep. slept inside the uh, sleeping bag with you. Mm -hmm. Yep, she slept inside. So she's all fed and her morning routine. So we're just gonna get out of here. Um, the sidling tunnel is just through there, you can see it. That's how far away we were, not, not very. Um, there's the road, just through those trees. So yeah, this was a good little spot. Um, we skipped the, um, the eggs the freeze-dried egg meals, even though we had this extra source of water here. But uh, I made it so we don't have to get down there and get some new water to filter. So we're good to go. We got just enough water to get us back to the car and we're fine. So, all right, Jenna, let's get going. These packs look heavy. Just making our way to the end of a uh, sidling tunnel here. Can just see the end. I don't know if you can see on camera, but we're just seeing another person just come into view. They're just getting inside the tunnel, it looks like. They got a dog. That's the first person that we've seen since yesterday after, uh, well, yeah, yesterday afternoon when we first got on the trail. I think they just came to the tunnel and ran back. Oh, maybe they're not going all the way? Maybe they see us and got creeped out. Hold on. Let's see if I can study this camera. Yeah. It's a she and she's running away. She's running away from us. All right, back to it. Mika's a good girl. We were just taking a break, getting her a drink of water. She was rolling around though, we missed it on camera. She was just rolling around. I think that uh, I think that harness has got her a little itchy. A little itchy spot. Now you're cold because we stopped. Let's give him a hug. Just 
making our way up. We figure we're probably about uh, maybe two thirds of the way back to the car, somewhere thereabouts. As, as you can probably tell, it's pretty windy out. The wind's coming straight at us. And we're going uphill. I don't know if you can see that on camera. Making our way. We're about in the middle of the tunnel, raised, raised hill tunnel, uh, just about back to the car. And there's a stiff breeze going through here, as you can probably hear. Uh, but it's been, uh, it's been a workout and it's been cold. This is kind of some, uh, I'd call it obscure camping, huh, Jenna? It's been a fun little adventure. All right, thanks a lot for watching.